Hey guys, it's Scott from Let's Play Easy Mode, and today we're gonna be diving back into the world of Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you're new here, then welcome to the channel. And if you're one of our regulars, then welcome back. Today we're gonna to be continuing on our journey through Age of Calamity. It's been so much fun to see this story unfold. Um, you know, it seems like we keep adding people to the war party, we're upgrading our powers, we're getting a lot of really cool cutscenes. Um, the last time that we played, we just really started seeing kind of just the I don't know, really the bonding of the champions now. We didn't get a chance to see that as much in Breath of the Wild. But now we're at a point where, you know, we, we've got the Master Sword for Link and we've got you know all of the, the heroes coming together. Uh, you know, the last time we saw them, they were kind of just doing their thing. And, and it was really interesting. We've seen also the interactions of Easy Bot. And this is where it gets to be a little bit of a mystery because Easy Bot, uh, has been interacting with Zelda, and Zelda seems to be getting some sort of flashback memories to being a child and seeing Easy Bot. Easy Bot was like singing a song to her, and she remembered that song from a, being a kid. And so it makes me wonder, you know, did Easy Bot travel from the future and see her as a kid? Like, I'm wondering where this is gonna branch off, because a lot of you guys have said that we're getting close to the point where it's no longer the Breath of the Wild prequel, but it's gonna branch off into its own timeline. And I'll be honest with you guys, this might seem like, you know, uh, heresy to some of you guys, but I'm kind of okay with it being its own thing. Um, you know, cause I already know, we've already played Breath of the Wild, I know what that timeline looks like, but it would be kind of cool to see something different, you know, um, where maybe the champions don't die. Maybe uh, the champions are somehow able to stop Calamity Ganon in this, you know, at this time period. Um, it would be really cool to see that, you know? It's like, you know, watching Loki on Disney Plus. It's like, it's no longer the, you know, the main canon Avengers timeline. It's pretty cool though, you know, it's fun. It does what it does. Um, so I'm excited to get into this with you guys and uh, and we're gonna dive in just a second. Before we do, I just wanna say, if you are enjoying this series, uh, then do me a favor and click like on it. Also, uh, subscribe to the channel for more content. If you're not already a subscriber, if you're one of those lurkers out there watching the videos, sure would really help the channel if you click that subscribe button. Come on in, join the community, it's a fun place to be. Uh, you can hang out with us over at Discord, the link for that is down below. And also, if you'd like to support the channel, you can do so by hopping on over to the Patreon page by going to this link right here, because for $5 a month, you get early release content. All of these videos go to Patreon first so you can see them as they're being made. For $10 a month, you get that, plus exclusive content, because we're playing some games over there. We got a whole library building of games that we're playing over there. Uh, that you will not see here on YouTube, uh, just for Patreon eyes only, but no matter what you sign up for, you can be a part of our Wednesday night exclusive Patreon live stream, which is so much fun to hang out on Wednesday nights together. Special thank you going out to our current list of patrons. These guys are amazing. Thank you so much for your support. If you're out there and you would like to join this amazing list of people, then make sure to hop on over and get signed up at Patreon today. Okay. Let's continue on. Guys, it's time to dive on into the story of Age of Calamity. Well, okay guys, we're getting ready to dive back into the world of Hyrule Warriors, Age of Calamity. And um, one thing I didn't mention during the intro um, that I did do, um, I haven't completely got all the grindy stuff out of the way, but uh, I talked in the last video about whether or not you guys because I was kind of questioning whether it was actually worth putting all this side quest, because some of this stuff is just like, hey, so-and-so needs this at a restaurant. You don't actually play a level, you just click it and that's it. And it's just a bunch of filler stuff. And then all the battles are pretty much the same kind of thing. Um, and so I, I posed the question to the community, would you guys rather just see the story levels? And uh, I just put a, uh, a poll out and uh, just a few minutes ago and already several people have been voting and it's like 79 percent of the of the folks who voted said that they would just as soon see the story 
aspect and leave all the grindy stuff for off camera. So what I did was I did a bunch of the leveling up, selling of weapons, forging of weapons, side battles, things like that. I've been doing that kind of on the side. Um, I'm actually gonna see eventually how it works just going and sitting on the couch and enjoying my Switch as a handheld uh, with those things. Uh, but so what we're gonna do is we're gonna pick up on this main quest right here called uh, Akala Tower. Um, so I'm excited to see where, where it's gonna go. Recommended level here is 25, and all our guys are, are um, boosted up. We got Link, Zelda, and Mifa, it looks like. So uh, I don't know if, if we're gonna need to switch who we are, if it really matters, but let's go ahead and see what the next chapter of the story holds for us. Oh, it looks like we can choose. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, hmm, I'm torn. Do I want Zelda? Ah, uh, you know, it looks like we can change this person. So let's let's put in Rivali, because I am a Rivali guy. Let's make sure we got all our upgraded weapons. Yep, and let's make sure that she has. I don't think she does. Yeah, she needs to be upgraded to this one. And and then Link has his Master Sword and Champion's tunic. So we are ready to go with that. Let's put in um, meal effects, rupees, damage from lightning, um, damage from enemies. Let's do that one. Okay, here we go, guys. Now we got some story. As the pilots learned how to manipulate the arcane machinery of their divine beasts, <laughs> Pura led a research expedition to the otherworldly place that had appeared on Hyrule Field. I've been calling her Pura all this time. Did he say Pura or Pura? Anyway, led a research expedition to the otherworldly edifice that had appeared on Hyrule Field. This Sheikah Tower was far from the only one of its kind. In fact, such structures were embedded deep in the earth throughout the kingdom. Mm. Their emergence controlled by a device inside Hyrule Castle. Interesting. Okay. To activate the control device, they would have to bond the Sheikah Slate with a Sheikah Tower. Yep. That's Zelda, what we do in Breath of the Ura, Wild. And the champions set out to do just that. Okay. Kind of like what we did in Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Studying relics again. Hmm? Uh oh. Father. You think you have time to busy yourself with things like that? It's just that I. I always feel so bad for her. Yeah, you tell him, Easy Bot. This is from a long time ago. It's a relic I found one day while Mother and I were out exploring. Mother and I. We discussed it at some length together. It seemed special, like it might hold hidden powers. Even after all this time, I've yet to unravel its purpose. But Father, if you allow me to uncover the meaning behind such relics, I believe it could help us to- Enough! Mm. That is not for you to determine. It doesn't mean I won't continue with my training, Father. But I also want- I want to explore all options, to do everything that I can. Even so, it seems that you are avoiding your duty. Hmm. I will allow it for now. But do not forget your mission. Hmm.
Well, I mean, you could give it back. If you're going to allow it, give it back. Interesting. Oh, more. More Yiga. So, if they can fix that Sheikah thingamajig, <laughs> what does that mean for me? I mean, us. That thingamajig will tell them where we are mm -hmm. and what we're doing. Okay. Uh, our cover would be blown, huh? Sounds like bad news. <laughs> Measures are being taken. Huh? Soon you'll each have your own parts to play. Hmm. Respect, sugar. This is a directive from Lord Ganon. Oh, apologies. Ooh, okay. <laughs> this guardian is possessed by Calamity Ganon, harbinger of destruction. With it, I will bring this world to its knees. <laughs> you are blind, seer. Calamity Ganon is not for mortals to control. Interesting. <laughs> that was a that was a, a bot like Easy Bot, but it had the malice on it. So was there like a good bot, an easy bot, and then like a evil bot? Evil bot versus easy bot. All right, here we go. That's awesome to see Pure like Zelda that. And now and Pure's got a voice too. Activated the central tower. Under Pura's guidance, Pura. they embarked on a Not mission Pura. to restore the ancient structures all across Hyrule. They had no notion that a shadowy foe was amassing all its might to disrupt their quest. The party headed for Akala, where the final tower awaited. As did a Yiga clan ambush. Okay, we got the. I wonder if this is a showdown with Suga now, finally. I actually fought Suga on one of those grindy side quests. He just disappeared after I beat him, but. Here we go. Let's send all the Yiga clan flying! Ooh, we got Master Sword, we got Link, he's just kicking butt. Love it. Oh, uh, this place used to have a research lab. Look, the Guardians, they were studying all still here. Okay. Uh, if we can activate a guardian with the little one, we may be able to clear the path. Okay. So you guys work on that, right? Right on cue. The army of Hyrule has arrived. There we go. Now Link is so powerful now. There you go. Got him. Yes. Are you like retreating? Okay. Oh. 
Oh, and EasyBot's gonna help turn the Guardians with us. Wonderful. Okay. Wait, do I want to go up here? What's up here? Oh, it looks like there's a Korok. <laughs> yeah! I can't get that thing, but all right, let's keep going. I guess I'll go this way, Ro. Ravali goes the other way. No, oh, maybe I shouldn't. Well, I don't know, do I? Do I want it? Might as well have some fun here. Uh, there's literally nothing down here. Probably have to work our way down here later. All right, let's work our way back. <laughs> huh. Can I cut through? Oh, I bet it's way up there and I can't. Yeah, it's probably up there on the bridge. All right, that's fine. Oh man, I probably need to go all the way back. Yep. Yeah. Well, tell you what, let's do this. Let's tell Link to go here. And see where he goes. And then let's be Rivali. Same with our girl Zelda. And uh, I'll take over Link. There we go. Let Rivali do the work here. Rivali has been, I used a lot of Rivali off camera. He's just about, I think at this point he and Link are like on the same level. Like Rivali has just been a beast. We'll get some of those gems, rubies, or whatever. And let's keep going. It's like a camp we might have to fight in. No. Nothing here. Very interesting. You really gotta stay, uh, I guess, on track on this one. There we go. And let's wipe out hundreds of Yiga clan all at the same time. Just because we can. Another block bridge. Can you manage this one, little knight? Ooh. Got one on me. Too easy. 
There we go. Uh, let's use the... Okay. Sure. Right here. Okay, so these things do have... What's going on? Does it have to be Link? Is that what the, the issue is? Okay, yeah, I'm hitting the... Let's be Link. Okay, there we go, sorry. I didn't know what I was doing. I might have been actually hitting the wrong button, to be honest. Nice. So all those places that we saw those little pod things. Where? I just want to be Rivali because he can do this. Clear the way. Uh oh, we got Suga back. thing I've learned you gotta use those room powers when you see them there we go nice Get Hang on. scorching sands the gates will not open uh, I recall a guardian within the Citadel if we activate it, it could break okay so I think we have to go back now to those other places. Oh, look at them all. Clear the way. Oh, Bros is over there. Clear some uh, some guys out here. Nice. The first has been activated. Okay. So I was hitting the wrong button. That's what it was. This way. To the next. And you too. And all of you. My goodness. There is no denying Rivali is crazy good. I love how you can take the tree. Ooh. There we go. There. Woo! Look at that. Activated, right? I can't blow those up. Uh, okay. Let's go. 
I just love how fast you can get to places with the Rivali too. Like you can get through a mission really quickly just by flying. Oh, look at them all. Link's out there doing his thing. I think we need to activate, yeah, we need to activate everything and we have to go down this way to do it. All right, let's fly. It's just easier to fly, you know? I love using Link, but. Gotta help Zelda. All right, come on, Zelda, let's go. <laughs> You're welcome. Guys, look at this. I'll tell you what, if this was Lord of the Rings and Sauron was, had his ring, he was in physical form and he's like fighting a Silgur and all of those guys. If they had Rivali, the movie would never have happened. Rivali would have taken down Sauron. That would have been it. Because he's Rivali. Which, it's crazy when you think that he was defeated by, uh, was it Windblight Ganon? Too easy. Does that mean Link beat Windblight? Twice. Clear the road. There we go. We're clearing them all out. The best thing is he builds up his super hits really quickly because you know, he's he's able to take out so many guys at the same time. I'm going the wrong way. Oh, but wait, there's more. Okay, where do I need to go? Back here? Uh, in there. He is blowing wind, look at this. There we go. Pardon me, everybody. Watch and learn. You stand a chance. We can go twice. Watch and learn. You stand a chance. Get another victory. Hey. Okay. That one's done. Pardon me, everybody. Bigger fish to fry. Flying this way. Gosh, can you imagine if little foes were this easy in the other game? Watch and learn. 
Watch and learn. There we go. This is awesome. Okay, we did it. We've done it. We have enough energy now. Let's activate the Guardian. Sounds good. You know what? I'm gonna be Link now. And I wanna make sure though that Rivali is coming up here with... Actually, let's get the whole party up here. Yep. And Rivali too. Everybody gets a link. All right, the Guardian Oculus Citadel is activated. Yeah. Guardians on a rampage, run away. Ooh, I love it. Now, into the Citadel. Okay. Uh, all that's left is to chase the Yuki clan out. Let's defeat their ringleader. Okay. Where? This way. Their ringleader was a bat. Boss time! It's Suga! I'm pretty sure that Link has this. He doesn't even need the other people. Look at that! We can just zigzag! Yeah, baby! And we got Rebosa with us anyway! Look at that, Link with his master sword. Getting the job done. Okay, we're not doing any damage at the moment. Oh, he's gonna boss up now. He's moved. Recapturing the city. Okay. We gotta find him. Can we... Wait. Gorok? Yeah, ha, ha These guys are always everywhere. Come on, guys. Let's go. We can get him. I ain't worried. Combat in this is so much easier. Look at that. Flurry rush. Have some bombs. Oops. Oh, wait, I can just do this. There, this might be it. There we go. Let me 
Yukas appear so effortless? How is it that you're this strong? Well, odor isn't everything. Whew! Alright, I guess we need to go this way. Right? Keep going up, I'm assuming. Oh, there's more guys. We're continuing on to seek after Suga. We might be on the right path. I see a lot of bananas. We know how they... They love their bananas in the Yiga clan. Got him. Are we done with this? There. Let's go up this way. Let's keep going, keep going. Oh, can we go in this door? No. I think we've come to a dead end. So let's go back and we'll go this way oh look at that they're they want to go up we can so let's go this way oh look at that we are going we are like slicing and dicing through this guys all right, keep it going. Suga, we found him. All right, we're gonna continue on. Weak spot. Nice, it's probably gonna disappear again. Right, perhaps next time then. Oh, has moved. Okay. Perhaps this time to that place we were at before with the open open door or the closed door. Let's find out. Let's see if we go up. Maybe that door will open up now. Yep. Attack, we must undo their forces. Suga has appeared. <gasps> Look at that! We did it! Oh, this is crazy. Let's uh let's hit them with some big powers. Got him. <gasps> we did it. 
he left again. Finally, he turned tail. Now we can restore. I get the impression we're not gonna be, he's gonna be like one of our final guys. Yes, with this, all the towers will be restored. It will serve us well in facing the calamity. I love how she says calamity. All right, guys, we did it. Not bad. All right, story time. Mushroom rice balls, that looks disgusting. <laughs> Here we go. What a magnificent view! We're so high up! <laughs> Pura? Have you found anything yet? I see. Hmm. So, by bonding this with the Sheikah Slave... There's princess, the music. Pura? Listen, Princess! These towers have got a lot of power hiding inside. The Sheikah Towers were designed to scan their surroundings for Calamity Ganon. When we activate them, the terminals load the Sheikah Slate with a map of the area. You can see the geography nearby and locate monsters as easy as click snap. I love this. So we can track down the enemy and take them by surprise. Precisely! Uh oh! Ooh, close call! Rather than just telling you about it, why don't I give you a little demo? <laughs> Easy bot. That's awesome. Guys, I love this. It sets us up for Breath of the Wild. You know, like the way they're figuring everything out. All right. Well, there we go. Now I got a bunch of things I got to do now in the grindy stuff. Oh my goodness. That was one thing. I actually didn't do all of it. I did a ton off camera. And this is what I'm talking about. Guys, it loads up with so much to do. I'm never going to get to all that. This is level 33. I could just level up our people and have them go in and do it. Destroy the Yiga clan. Interesting. So that's the next one. Well, that's where we're going to go next. In the meantime, I'm going to do uh, off camera. I'm going to do a little bit of grindy things. I'm going to uh, upgrade our party. And uh, and then we will work on destroying the Yiga clan. It looks like we're going back to the base uh, over by Gerudo. Um, so I'm looking forward to doing that. But we will do that next time. Well, okay, guys, that's going to do it for this episode, and that was a lot of fun. We got to see the connection of the uh, Sheikah, uh, you know, towers with the Sheikah slate, and uh, that was really cool. We got a chance to hang out with Pura, 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 not Pura, Pura, Pura. That girl right there. We got a chance to hang out with her, and and uh, it, it was really cool to continue to see that story evolve. And uh, my word, all of these side missions just like exploded on the map once we finished this. Um, but you know, we'll we'll continue on. It looks like we're going to be having our final battle with the Yiga Clan. Uh, you know, and uh, I say final because I mean, kind of laughing at that because we know they're going to play a big factor coming up a hundred years later during breath of the wild or who knows maybe we're starting to branch off a little bit uh i'm still kind of waiting for that moment that you guys were talking about where this is going to obviously not be heading in the direction of breath of the wild anymore i'm not really sure we've hit that moment yet it feels like it could still be very much breath of the wild you know like her dad uh king rome was there looking at the relic in her hand and he was doing the usual thing don't you know waste your time with relics and uh and then he kind of changed his tune because then easy bot was like ribber, 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 ribber. and then king rome was like well I'll, I'll excuse it this time and i don't know was that a turning point does that give her the chance to look at some relics that's going to affect the battle against calamity ganon 
I don't know, but we'll find out as we continue on the story. I really hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. If you are, make sure to click like on this video and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more content because we'd love to have you come on in and join the community here. Uh, hang out with us at Discord. The link for that is down below. And of course, you can always dive in deeper with me by hopping on over to the Patreon page, which you can get to by going to this link right here. Guys, I love you so much, and thank you so much for taking time out of your day, a very busy day for so many people, and you take time out of it to hang out with me and just chill and kick back and play some games. I really appreciate it. I appreciate you. Love you guys so much, and I'll talk to you soon. But until then, take it easy. Great